welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle today I'm going to be doing popular places to travel next year 2021 so before we do that if you click the red and white subscribe button and also click the notification bell i upload uh, between three to six times a week this week i'm uploading five times a week so uh, let's jump right into it now according to www.forbes.com there's three fantastic countries in the world um, that are going to be on the popular places list um, next year 2021 so let's fire away with the first country which is in Africa and it's the country Kenya it's also won tourism awards as well this year and Kenya was chosen by Melissa Biggs Bradley of Indigala uh, USA uh, why uh, because Kenya is always a classic and it has uh, fantastic landscapes and uh, they are a definition of wide open spaces which will make it um, more appealing than ever uh, during the time of social distancing and uh, COVID-19 throw some stylish new hotel offerings wow and it's no wonder Kenya is uh, topping the Ingala 2021 hot list don't miss the diehard travellers uh, might recall fashion designer Anna Trabzemski eco chick safari lodge the lama Rati's camp which closed unfortunately a few years ago but now the designer is backed with a great new retreat called eden in nairobi which is based in nairobi in the capital of kenya and it combines the Messiah and Sambru tribe elements and traditions with her late um, husband's art. So, wow, that uh, sounds really interesting and fantastic. And um, number two on the list um, is the brilliant uh, and fantastic Costa Rica, chosen by Julie De Sing of Embark Beyond um, why because Costa Rica has maintained one of the lowest COVID-19 uh, fat fatality rates in Latin America and its government has been recognised for its successful management and containment of the virus wow this uh, this is exciting so when the country reopens um on november the 1st uh, which it's already open now at uh, 2020 uh, there's there are incredibly high uh, luxury eco lodges don't also miss uh, the ha galency Ah, uh, excuse my pronunciation, Alta Garcia, part of the Orbridge collection. Wow, it looks f amazing. This place is just a gem. You can uh, get in touch with nature without having uh, to get out of touch with luxury. So, wow, that um again sounds promising if you like luxury but you also like nature at the same time so you don't need to compromise um other ex exciting openings in costa rica are the nature tented camp a, a glamping lodge in 
a renal a volcano national park wow it looks amazing coming in 2021 also six senses pi Ageo, excuse my pronunciation the company's first resort in central america and back nick osler peninsula serio excuse my pronunciation again collection by the fabulous in hilton chain where guests can expect immersive rainforest experience and world cl uh, class sport fishing wow that sounds fantastic and it also looks amazing um moving on um to the last but not at least a country um are the british virgin islands uh, chosen by kimberly wilson wetty of valerie wilson travel why uh, because the virgin islands have always been a sailor's paradise so if you love sailing on water then again british virgin islands it could be the choice for you or if you want to try something different just say with breathtaking scenery and 60 plus mountains so again if you're a mountaineer then again um it it could be a good again a fabulous place as well to cl climb mountains constantly visible on the horizon so mountains of this constantly visible hot on the horizon with a december the first reopening date 2020 that's next month so not long to go uh, pre prestigious new properties and private islands to rent wow seems really exciting and um, the scenery looks uh, absolutely amazing wetty says uh, that there's never been a better time to socially dis distance on a vacation in the british virgin islands she cannot fit, uh, wait to see um rosewood little dicks bay again it looks amazing on uh the photos you can even google, uh, google it as well and uh, a visit is also she says not complete without a day um sailing and a drink or two at the soggy dollar bar and uh, she says there's, there's so many also favorite caribbean beach bars there um in the british virgin islands so if you like a, a drink then again you've got a choice of a beach bars also do not miss the most idyllic places in the british virgin islands so richard branston's nectar island which is renowned for being incredibly eco-friendly this year the island has introduced three wind turbines wow that sounds amazing and Saba rock a iconic island basically a rest stop for sailors and yachties so again the islands are fantastic uh, for maybe those who uh, want to relax but also they're fantastic for people that like to go on yachts and boats and um want to explore mountainous regions as well so wow i would like to say thank you for watching please like and su subscribe and share and um my next vlog is going to be tomorrow and it's uh, my latest travel updates at 6 30 so don't miss that and 
also tomorrow I'm going to be uploading my free to November 2020 travel newsletter it deals with um, travel aspects in the UK and worldwide so thank you for watching please stay safe everybody no matter where you are in the world and um, I'll see you tomorrow thank you and bye for now thank you bye